In a time where donut shops are all the rage, one particular spot in Hamilton's North End has become a bit of an institution, but they give the people what they want, and that is more donuts. Granddad's Donuts said it'll be closing its doors for renovations. This is the midday crowd at Granddad's Donuts, and rarely does a person leave with just one pastry. Just half a dozen donuts just for me? Just a little uh, tasty bite after lunch. Perhaps some are stockpiling for something that hasn't happened in 16 years. Granddad's closing. The Hamilton staple is shutting its doors January 29th for extensive renovations that should last two months. The reason for the renos? to make more donuts. When we first opened, uh, we weren't making nearly what we're making now, so we have no space. Part owner Carly Grant says the retro aesthetic will remain, but seating will be reduced to make room for the larger kitchen. The extensive closure will definitely seem odd for staff who literally have donuts in their blood. My aunt owns the store. She's recently had uh, her daughter and I be part owner, so it's keeping it in the family. Carly's Aunt Barb, a longtime employee at Tim Hortons, wanted to open up her own shop, and since then, it's appeared on CHCH. Can I go in, Barb? Go for okay. it. <laughs> and even in music videos for Granddad's groupies, Arkells. Despite the retro vibes, Granddad's Donuts has only been around since 2007. So what's up with this place? Such a short amount of time have such a strong following. I'm still eating this. Cheers. For some, it's the donuts themselves. And they're much more bigger than any other donut place you go to. For others, it's everything you can't buy. She used to play hockey at East Mount Arena. So we used to pop in here and get donuts and hot chocolate. It's family friendly. Yep. It's nice to come, enjoy. Our customers, like some of them have been invited to our weddings and yeah, they've just, they're part of the family. It really is just one giant family here.